To talk more about what went on tonight and its likely effect on the campaign, let's welcome in pollster John Zogby, who Skypes in tonight from Utica, New York. Uh, John, you watched. You haven't been tabulating yet, uh, but we have heard some talk that very rarely do debates change the poll numbers all that much. What say you in the wake of this first debate between Mr. Trump and Secretary Clinton? I headlined a piece that I just wrote for Forbes. Uh, Clinton uh, scores debate points, but not polling points. I'm going to give her uh, the edge. She was clearly prepared, although don't let anybody kid you. So was Donald Trump. He was very prepared to debate. I think that they had some uh, some real tough blows at each other. But in the final analysis, don't expect the polling uh, points to move by the end of the week. Now, this is interesting because it, it raises a topic that we talked about earlier, and that is those of us who have run for public office, served in public office, done polling, uh, been around politics. A lot of us looked at Donald Trump tonight and said, gee, he really missed some opportunities. But you're saying even though Hillary, to quote political professionals, scored debate points, it will not translate in terms of public opinion polling. Why is that, John? Well, there are a lot of people who are undecided. And remember, uh, you know, there are a lot of people that don't like either candidate. And neither candidate gave a compelling argument for why undecided should like them. Uh, I mean, Donald Trump played to his constituency and did it very well. And I think where he scored is he looked plausibly presidential and he was prepared. Um, Hillary Clinton, you know, the same old, same old. I mean, she was the prototypical. She was Michael Dukakis, Al Gore, John Kerry, very well prepared, but not you know, particularly uh, someone that, that you can bond with. And look, bonding uh, is, is very important. You got to seal the deal, and it will be interesting to see in the days ahead if uh, some of these undecideds are claimed by, by the Green Party candidate or by the Libertarian. Uh, John Zogby, tonight from Utica, New York. As always, we appreciate your insights and analysis.